Hi there. Uh, Mick Kenyon here from Open Tracking. Uh, one of the questions we, we uh, often get is how do we merge GPX files? Um, so if we're setting up an event or, or you're uploading your own KML file uh, to a tracking page, um, it needs to be one single file. So you might have three different routes uh, which you've created uh, a GPX for. Um, and one of the, the tools which you can create GPX files in is Rider with GPS. That's probably um, as good as any. Um, but once you've created those files, you, you'll, you'll want to make it into one single KML file. And you might also want to change the colours on, on each of the routes. So uh, we'll dive straight in. And the, the tool which we use is GPS Visualizer. And so it's gpsvisualizer.com. Uh, you can see that up at the top there. Um, and so once you've, you've typed in that address onto uh, your, your browser, if you then click onto Google Earth, and this is the, the opening screen which you'll get there. So uh, first thing you want to do is choose the files you want to merge together. So uh, I'll just go into here where I've got a couple of um, files. So I'll add that one and also the second one, which is group day, uh, group two there. Uh, I'll just create these two for this example. Um, and then the other thing you need to change is from a KMZ to a KML. And then we need to change that over to line width 6. And um, then we need threshold of 75. Um, if you're going to add demographic um, elevation data, you need to add that to best available source. Um, check that default color is on red. And the other thing which we change is um, show waypoints down as none. And then once you've done that, then you can create your KML file. So that creates there if you click on that, and then we get a, a KML there. So you download the KML, and once you've got your KML, um, you can then open that in a text editor. So if you go, uh, I'm on a Mac, so there's uh, an inbuilt text edit there. Open that up, and then you'll see the the um, KML of the two routes there. So the thing which we're changing here is the colours. So um, so there is a, a, um, a, a, a these are all hex keys um, so or hex code colours. So what we'll do there is 3C which uh, changes the um, opacity or, or um, the colouring of, of, of the, the track there, of how see-through it is. So 3C, 0, 0, uh, 0, 0, FF. So that, that creates a red um, track. And then if I go down to the next colour, one down here, and if I put in 3C, FF, 0, 0, 0, 0, and that creates a blue one. So then once we've done that, we need to make sure that we change that. So we could call that merged. KML and um, and then that that's uh, added over there. So the next thing to do is if we were on self service manager, if you, you have access to self service manager, you create your KML. So you click into the KML, choose the file, um, and then from your downloads, if you click on the merged there, and um, then you'll need to save that. Once that's saved, if you can check that on the tracking page um, and in this instance it's down here in the south and you can see the two KMLs have been created. Hope you found that useful. Um, oh yeah just one other thing before uh, I disappear is back to GPS visualizer um, on their home page or actually any of the pages there's a little donation button there so if you found GPS visualizer uh, useful uh, if you'd like to make a donation Okay, thank you.